and we're really happy that all you guys are here. Um, why don't we go around the circle and introduce ourselves with that name? Like, it's awesome. But um, you can say uh, something about yourself, like where you're from, um, where you've been mom before, why you're here, something. We were house sitting for friends of ours who were part of the very CSA last year, and so we came and got to pick during one of their weeks and enjoyed the fruit and are here to help this year. I've been, uh, I guess, I think I'm a role photographer for Forgot Mob, and I'm also, I study soil science at Cornell, and I'd never known about this oh, place, so I'm really excited to learn about it. My name's Ryan, I'm with Kira and them. We do community garden and driving. We did the Prop Mob at that other place earlier in the year, last month. I'm Katie. I'm Katie. <laughs> I'm the farmer. <laughs> I'm the cook. Do you mind just explaining oh. a little bit about what the farm is for people that aren't familiar? The farm is a UPIC CSA that's devoted entirely to small fruit. So um, anything that is not much bigger than this. Um, they have about eight different varieties, roughly a quarter of an acre each. And uh, people buy season memberships that entitle them to um, pick once a week. I have a roughly seven week, six or seven week season now. I'm eventually aiming to get it all the way from June to October. Yeah. And I'll do my planting spiel out there. So, uh, let's head out there. The first one is what Micah is doing now, namely weed. Um, I would like initially as many people as there are weeding tools here um, to do that. Um, and the point is to get out. Well, my name is Rachel Gerak, and I'm one of the organizers of the Crop Mob in Ithaca. And this is our second year, and um, every year now we've established a pattern of going to Kestrel Perch Berry and helping Katie out with some berry tasks. And last year we weeded and hilled a whole bunch of raspberry bushes, just a whole bunch. It was great. And this year we put in tons of blueberry bushes. And I'd say we had last year maybe about 30 volunteers, and this time we had a little more, maybe around 40 or 45. And um, in a couple hours we got several rows done. I should get a, an estimate from her about how many. But um, we come because we want to help out uh, Katie. She's part of the local landscape of farmers. and. The Cartman really loves to support its local farms and establish a very interdependent community around farming. So that's why we're here. And Katie's um, a great educator and she's been uh, teaching members about, um, about small fruit production and organic berry production and, and all that. And she's, she's very unique as a UPIC Berry CSA. So we're excited to learn what we can from her too. I actually used to live uh, in Eco Village uh, many years ago, um, and I've been coming to as many crop hops as I possibly can. <laughs> 